Is this man, Barack Hussein Obama, the fulfillment of Islamic prophecy? In the prophetic commentary on the Koran, Bukhari, Volume 6, Book 60, Number 159, it says, Allah's apostle said, The hour will not be established until the sun rises from the west. And when the people see it, then whoever will be living on the surface of the earth will have faith. In the Asian and Middle Eastern cultures, symbols have much more meaning than they do in the West. Is it just a coincidence that Barack Hussein Obama's campaign symbol is the sun rising over the ultimate symbol of the West, the flag of the United States of America? Obama's father was a Muslim. Unlike in Christianity, where you choose to accept Jesus Christ as your Savior by faith, in Islam, sons and daughters are automatically Muslims by virtue of their father being a Muslim. Barack Hussein Obama claims to be a Christian, yet he can't tell you when he became born again, that moment he accepted Jesus as his Savior. He believes Muslims can be saved even though they reject that Jesus is God and faith in Jesus will save your soul. While Barack Hussein Obama claims to be a Christian, he believes the lie that there are many roads that lead to God and takes positions in complete rebellion to Christ and the Bible on issues like abortion, homosexuality, and Israel. Is Barack Hussein Obama really a Christian? No. Is Barack Hussein Obama really a Muslim? Yes, by birth meaning he will be sympathetic to those in this false religion that calls for the death of all infidels, non-Muslims, and whose very real and stated goal is the overthrow and destruction of the United States of America. Barack Hussein Obama thinks he is the one to save America, when in fact he may be the one Muslims have prophesied about. My friend, there's only one savior of this world, his name is not Barack Hussein Obama, it is Jesus Christ.